Well, in the preseason, we were ranked about 29th, 30th, somewhere around there. Um, we seem to have a very good uh, season coming out. Um, I thought it would turn out pretty well. Out of conference schedule, we did very well. We were 4-0. We didn't lose a single game out of conference. Well, the whole school was kind of hoping for a miraculous season, uh, you know, to go all the way and win the national championship, of course, as we hope for every year. Um, obviously, it was a more realistic uh, result. At the end of the season overall, I was pretty pleased with our record and how we performed overall. There were definitely certain games where it was not the Vanderbilt football team what I knew it could be. I think our team did, pr did pretty well. It didn't have very high expectations for us. I went to one game and I believe we lost brutally. We um, it was definitely a better season than I was expecting, especially when we beat Florida and Georgia in the same season. That was awesome. But as I'm someone who's from St. Louis, our homecoming game was really disappointing. Uh, but I'm happy that they had another nine-win season. They pulled it around. They looked like they were going to be a little rough at the beginning, uh, but it had a nice win streak going on at the end, and, and the bowl game was an impressive win. James Franklin, I feel, has just completely revolutionized this team. I think his spirit just completely rejuvenated the entire school and how we look at um, the football team. Franklin was the first person in a long time who actually believed in the program and set out to build not only a program but also a culture of football. We've actually started implementing a system to where we have to give out tickets before the games because everyone's so interested in going to the games. Um, obviously I think there's still a lot of work to do. I think we can always be better but it's nice to see people actually showing up to the games. I remember my freshman year I'd go and there would be a third of the student section there max. I think he's a great icon for the students and I think that he has had a huge impact just as a football coach on the players but more than that he's had an impact on the school and I think that's also part of our success and I really hope we can hold on to him for a few more years. Um, I would say that there's no other campus that will appreciate him like we do, um, especially seeing the change he's brought here, kind of leading into a new era. It's only been three years. There's a lot of work to do here that just he would not have the same personal impact on Penn State's history. I think that the program right now needs James Franklin. And I know for me personally as a fan, like I need him to stay. He is one of the major reasons that I believe in the program. And I think that he needs a couple more years. James Franklin, you've been with us this far. Uh, we love the spirit you have, you've given us. We will literally beg on our hands and knees to keep you at this school, and we love what you have done with this program. Please stay. Be here for the long haul, take Vanderbilt into a dynasty, be the face of the school. We really need it.